Hey, what's going on guys? It's Jamie here. Thanks for joining me in today's video and welcome to the channel. If this is the first time here, I'd like to say a very warm welcome to you. My name's Jamie. I'm a full-time affiliate marketer, digital ad strategist. I'm a coach for a program. We've got over 596 students at the time of recording. If you're interested in really ramping up your affiliate marketing business from a no BS foundational standpoint, feel free to hit the uh, button below that's going to lead you through to a case study and you're welcome to book in a time with myself if you'd like to learn how to build a business based on the foundations of sales, marketing, offer creation, all that fun stuff. Anyway, what I'm talking about today, just going to be a real quick one. wanted to jump on here and basically just let you guys know if you're grinding away on uh, your affiliate business or online business in general, whether it's coaching or course creation, all that sort of stuff. The thing about humans is we have a finite amount of time every day. We have a finite amount of energy every single day. And I think as entrepreneurs, sometimes we get into this mode of just burning the candle at both ends. We're not sleeping. We're living off caffeine. We're smashing ourselves as best as we can or as as much as we possibly can in order to start hitting our goals. And I think sometimes it pays just to take a bit of a step back and actually find that balance in your life. Now, I, for one, uh, am kind of guilty of uh, just pushing myself to to the brink of breaking point a lot of the time. Uh, As I say, I think it's a curse for entrepreneurs in general. So today I'm in a little bit of a different location. I've just taken a couple of days off. I've actually hung out with my business partner and his family, Jacob Karras, gone up to the uh, lovely Barossa Valley in South Australia, just north of Adelaide there. Absolutely amazing. And uh, him and I have parted ways now. He's, He's gone off to do some other stuff and... Me and myself, I'm here uh, with my wife. We just got this accommodation and the only place we had available to book happens to be this entire huge blooming house, like three bedrooms, actually an old uh, horse stable that's been converted into accommodation. It's just uh, got this beautiful rustic feel. And uh, yeah, we're only here for a couple of nights before we head back to Melbourne and back to the, the grind, so to speak. But like I say, the reason for this is that I think a lot of people, and, and like I say, you know, massive, massive, finger pointing at myself here for this one is that I get caught up in this thing of, of you know, I need to be pushing and if I'm not, if I'm not pushing hard and if I'm not like working my butt off every single day, then I'm losing traction in my business, I'm lo- losing momentum, I'm losing potential leads, potential sales, all that sort of stuff. And I think sometimes the opposite is actually true and forcing yourself to take time away from the screen or time away from uh, your normal place where you, you do all your work, it's actually massively beneficial because it means that you're going to have renewed energy. I know for myself, even though I've only been in this very location for a couple of hours at the time of recording, I've come up with all sorts of great ideas. I've got things happening for months ahead now uh, that I hadn't anticipated, hadn't even thought of before. So this new uh, newfound creative energy is now flowing into the stuff that I'm putting out there and, and what I will be putting out there moving forward as well. So I think that side of it is actually massively beneficial. The other thing I was, was going to say off the back of that as well was going back to that, that comment about the inherent guilt that a lot of us feel when we're not you know burning the candle at both ends we're not like smashing out these huge 12 hour days uh, and we're not potentially getting the traction in our business that we'd like and of course you know logically we think well i've applied the idea of hard work to other uh, facets of my life i'll just apply this to the online world and things will work out but some of us as, as we've discovered perhaps the hard way it doesn't always transpire like that a lot of the time it really is just mean making sure that you do have that form of balance in your life that way when you are actually concentrating you're not sitting there with 900 tabs open really unclear about what you're meant to be focusing on what tasks you need to be doing in order to start growing your business or in order to scale your business if that's the case if that's what you're up to so um, big advice for everyone is uh, remove that pressure from yourself take that guilt away from yourself if you are just burning it as much as you possibly can to get whatever it is finished. And by all means, I'm not suggesting for a moment that you you go the other way and become super lazy with your business. What I am saying is that it's actually really important from a creative perspective and an energetic perspective in order to be able to have sustainability in this business. Uh, I've been doing this for around about actually just over 10 years at the time of recording. And I think it's because of this balance and the fact that I'm, I'm quite happy to take some time off and, and uh, remove myself from my own audience or remove myself from my own environment and try and find ways to renew that level of creativity that I've been able to sustain uh, what I've done for, like I say, over a decade at the time of recording. So 
Anyway, that's it for today. I'm just going to go and uh, finish off the work I've got to do here. Um, anyway, I appreciate you guys tuning in. If you'd like to learn more about what I'm up to and how I can actually help you smash your financial goals in 2021 and beyond, I would encourage you to click that link below. Check out the free case study. And if that's of interest to yourself, feel free to lock in a time with myself. I'll be able to uh, put a map together in order to help you start smashing your goals. And of course, there is an option there to work together should that be of interest as well. Anyway, my name is Jamie. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Smash that like button, drop a comment. Let me know your thoughts. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks very much. Bye-bye.